Today is National Vietnam Veterans Day. It is March 29th, honoring the men and women who served and sacrificed during one of the longest conflicts in American history, the Vietnam War. Retired Army Sergeant David Hack served and was wounded during his Vietnam service. That was back in 1968. Sir, I salute you and your service and what you're doing today. Um, I have read your backstory. It is fascinating. Um, March 29th was the day officially American forces left Vietnam. The war continued for about two more years. Tell us why today is so significant for those who were there. You know, it's important for a Vietnam veteran to communicate with his friends, his neighbors, and fellow veterans that served in Vietnam. Communication is so vital. Uh, anyone that goes through war and, and survives needs to talk about it, needs to converse, needs to share his story, and needs to let his family know that he's okay. We have s such a big problem now with veterans that go over there and, and, and they're in combat, they come back and they keep it inside themselves. You know, we, we, we have to encourage all veterans, no matter what war it is, to talk about it. Get it off, off your chest. And that's extremely important. I am also the licensee for the Purple Heart Foundation. And we encourage that. Uh, we encourage people to share their story. We encourage people to, to reach out and, and, and ask questions. And there's mm -hmm. nothing wrong with that. It really isn't. And uh, Sergeant, get it off where, where, your do you, chest. where do you tell them to go um, when you give them that advice? <laughs> you know, we tell them to first go to the VFW, go to the American Legion. Then after that, go to schools and talk about it. Be a guest speaker. Uh, talk about it at church. Talk about it uh, with your family. Just, just talk about it. You know, and it, like I said before, it's, it's so important. Yeah. And, you know, Vietnam veterans are extremely intelligent. They really are. And they're, they're not young. We're older people. But we have so much knowledge and so much, so much savvy that, that it's important. And, and you have to understand that an awful, awful lot of Vietnam veterans own their own businesses. And I own my own business. I own U.S. Wings. And we're extremely well known. And we have people that come into our, our business, and to our store, and, and, and converse and talk. You got a great and, message. And that's important. Yeah, you got a great message. Yeah. David, thank you so much. It's really an honor to talk to you. Take care of Cleveland, Ohio. I salute your service. Sergeant David Hack, thank you for coming in. March 29th, 1973. Thank you. Thank you, sir.